UN war crimes judges ruled that aging Rwandan genocide suspect Felicien Kabuga is unfit to stand trial but should still go through a stripped down legal process in a decision announced Wednesday. Kabuga, who is 88 according to officials but claims to be 90, is a former tycoon accused of setting up a hate broadcaster that fueled the 1994 slaughter of around 800,000 people. Kabuga went on trial in the hog in September last year, but judges said medical experts had now found that he had severe dementia and could not take part properly in court. The International Residual Mechanism for Criminal Tribunals said in an order that it therefore finds that Mr. Kabuga is not fit for trial and is very unlikely to regain fitness in the future. Judges said they wanted to adopt an alternative finding procedure that resembles a trial as closely as possible but without the possibility of a conviction. It was important to, con to victims, survivors and the international community that the genocide crimes against Kabuga still be addressed in court, the justice added. One judge dissented. Prosecutors accuse Kabuga, once one of Rwanda's richest men, of establishing hate media that urge ethnic Hutus to kill rival Tusis and supplying death squads with machetes. The businessman refused to appear in court or appear remotely at the start of this trial and has subsequently followed proceedings via video link from a wheelchair at the court's detention center. The court first put the trial on hold in March over health concerns having earlier dismissed bird bits by Kabuga's defense lawyers to have him declared unfit to stand trial. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.